Hello again, everyone. I'm Lady the Outcast, and if this floor is the one I think it is, then you might be seeing me die. Yep, this is the one I'm thinking of. You see how there was no Atla at all there? It, the little floor plan didn't show any Atla at all. That means a special event will occur at this floor. What special event? This. <gasps> Bring it. One-shotted! Ha, you missed! Oh, hey, dropped it in. Bread! Uh-oh. This guy looks mean. What? What do you want? I told you to get lost. Duel. That sounds interesting. Basically, um, because I'm not going to let him finish speaking. I'm going to leave him there, because the duel will start if I try that. What a duel is, basically, it's like Dance Dance Revolution. You want to try and get it into that lighter part of the sexy little blue ball on the bottom. And, uh, try to get into the lighter shaded areas. If you get into the lightest part, you'll get a, uh, all in the lightest part, you'll get a special reward. Uh, for each time you do it. And, uh, you can screw up, and apparently there's a glitch in my copy where even if you execute it at the right time, it'll still count as an epic fail. But if I don't do this right, you will actually see me die. Because almost every duel sequence has a death sequence, too. If you mess up, um, you die and you get to start the thing over. However, um, there's only one duel that does not have a death scene. Uh, I'll get into that when I get to it. Yeah, you'll always see that little exclamation mark flashing around whenever the duel's about to start. Like that! <laughs> Got it! Haha! <laughs> First try. And you'll see this. Excellent! A present from the Fairies of Terra, and you'll get a random gem. Now, this chest will always contain the key. Now, depending on either if you get clear or perfect, depending on which one you get, this chest will have something different. If you just get a regular old clear and don't do it exactly perfect, you'll get an attachment called the Undead Buster. However, if you do like I did and get perfect, you get that. Really nice. And that was a really short floor, so we'll continue on here. Oh, I told you to buzz off! I don't want to listen to you! Go, shoot! I know how to do a charge attack, I already explained that to people. Okay, this is where another thing where the people think it's Zelda. That second sword looks like the Master Sword. Let me really look at it. And then, uh, yeah, this tells you about status breaking. Uh, you basically destroy your weapon to get a sense fair of all the attributes in it. Uh, yeah, we've already been through this. Go away. We all hate you, go away. Well, let's make this quick. Uh, let's go the path less traveled by. Let's exit. One of these ways leads to the exit, yeah. Okay, this is the way I want to go. Just path less traveled by. Now, unfortunately, I have to find those stupid bats. Ice! That's an attachment that gives, well, ice. One hit it. Got another thing, endurance plus two. Always nice. 
Basically, once you get a new sword, you can pretty much one-shot anything in here, except for the big enemies like statues. Renee. Who's Renee? 